All right, so Bobby and I were discussing the rims for Anna's. I got some over here. Yeah, for Anna's uh, 65 convertible. And what it basically comes down to is if I can avoid doing aftermarket stuff on these original cars, I'm going to. So we are going to painstakingly go through our collection of rims. And um, Anna, we want to give you original rims, not aftermarket rims. Um, can we do it at the same price? Price could be price a little bit more. It'll probably be a little, probably bit, a little bit more because we're going to sandblast them, paint them uh, gloss black, and then put the new tires on them. But I really want to um, recommend. I mean, you you can stop us, and I'll keep these rims for myself and put them on my own. What are my own restorations? But if I can give you original parts on your car, that's what I'm going to do, Anna. So. That was a winner. That was like flawless. So we're going to find four of the those similar rims. And if they're all exact matches, I'm going to have uh, them uh, sandblasted and then painted gloss black, probably with a 500 degree Rust-Oleum uh, gloss black. Yeah, we got to pull that. We gotta, we're going to have to pull that tire. Yeah. So uh, that's what's going on with Anna's today. And um, we, what is this paper gasket situation, Bobby? Talk to me. Talk to him on the video. There's a gas who's who's, 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 who's diff is that? That's Sanders. As soon as the diff's done, oh, it's gonna it's gonna be put there. Okay. Done right now. So tell them about this paper gasket thing on Anna's because we're doing an Anna video. All right, this is on Anna's, but it also applies to Sandra, Yor, and Casper. As of now, you don't really need them when you're replacing stuff. Say we just have a car come in, and you just pull a diff, clean it, pull the uh, axles. Oh yeah, of course, pull the axles. You gotta pull the axles, pull the diff. My arm's going to fall asleep. Get to a point. Get to the point. You didn't call me Vanessa that time. Go, go, anyway, go. So you pull the backing plate off, and there's a gasket in there between the backing plate and the housing from the factory. Any one of these cars that comes in, it's not there anymore. They're 50 years old. Do you really, really, really need it for it to function? No. But because these are full-on restorations, we're putting them in there. It's that attention to detail. Yeah. It's going to delay us a day, but we want to go. We're, we're doing everything we can with Anna's and a number of cars to be as factory perfect as possible. They're actually they're going to be better than factory they're because be they're being so factory. they're being so cared for. We even upgraded the welds to strengthen Anna's frame. So um, we're going to wait a day on Anna's for progress. She's going to sit on the lift. We might see them. We might see the gaskets at the end of the day, at the end of the day today. But we're we're waiting to put those axles on. The um, rims. The rims. We're going to we're going to refurbish these rims. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to track down four original rims for and refurbish those uh, with a minor adjustment to cost going uh, full on original. I know how Anna feels about that, so I'm comfortable with making this call. And if not, we can always just order the, 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 the remand uh, rims. They're not and get remand, they're, they're new, but they're aftermarket. The aftermarket, so yeah. Perfect. Aftermarket's never quite, we try to avoid aftermarket. Sometimes we have to go aftermarket, but we try to avoid it. Also, the hunt. For the nice hubcaps, the wire hubcaps with the spinners, with the blue centers, you guys know which ones. Mustang Medic Alert on that. We're looking for a set for Anna's. Let us know. Right. Yeah. So we're yeah we, we need a set of spoke hubcaps for a '65 Mustang, and we're doing white walls, and we're doing original rims not, on the car. We're not doing white walls. They didn't want to do white walls. They're doing they're doing BF Goodriches because they want a better tire. Black white wall. Walls, yeah, we'll put the letter inside. Oh, uh, really? On Anna's? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, All right, so we're doing. Better tire. Okay, it's not no no white walls. No white walls because the white wall tires that that you get they're not they're not the greatest of tire. Sorry, I'm just being a traditionalist. Oh, I, traditionally Fine. yes, but black walls. Safety wise. Yeah, since this car is going to Switzerland, it's got to it's got to meet a lot of speed standards. So we are doing everything top of the line on this car, and guys. At the moment, I don't think this is the one. This one's for sale, unless if somebody drops like, "Hey, here's one hundred twenty thousand dollars because I saw everything go into it." They would probably be tempted, but at the moment, they're not planning, uh, and is not planning on selling this car. No, it's, <laughs> it's going to be gonna beautiful. Be it's stuff. beautiful. Um, beautiful. Yeah. Now, now I'm right very, right. very, very proud of the cars that are coming out of Mustang Medic, and I thank you to Anna and everybody for the opportunities of being able to do it on video and showcase our work. It's helping us get to a higher standard in the world. Oh, sorry, I got it on my soapbox. Let me get back down. Oh, there you're average height, Bobby. 
Uh, but anyway. Uh, <laughs> See if I get off my soapbox. Yeah. So yes, exactly. So we're gonna we're gonna um, go with original rims on. That's what this five minute video is about. Thank you for watching. We appreciate you guys. Yippee ki yay. <laughs>